All right, guys, Pitching Ace 88. We are doing the mini games. This is on Bottomy. This game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. And this is going to be a uh, post recording. My problem was is I've been sick, so I was actually able to record a good three hours completing every single mini game. Uh, I'm only going to show my successes. I really only failed in in one, and that was uh, last stand. And I'll show you my successful run and wh how it how it worked out. So this one's on bottom me. <coughs> Sorry, that'll happen a lot. My my imit the imitator is very useful in these things, and I normally put the imitator as a sunflower at least in this one, because what you're gonna want is you're gonna want as many sunflowers because you need to get uh, wall tall nuts as quickly as possible and potato mines are god in this because they cannot be destroyed by the plant zombies I put that potato mine there just in case someone decided to come up on that area and try and take out my sunflowers and I believe pretty soon here I'm going to probably want to put a tall nut. Yeah, that was not smart. Okay. I had to put that squash there because that probably wasn't the smartest idea. What you, what you want to do is as soon as possible uh, put a tall nut right there. Okay, this guy's getting really close. I can't remember. I might just let him go, to be honest with you. Yep, I just let him go. So, cool. And I'm not really worried about money. I know the Game Anyone thing is going to cover it, but I meant like 40 or 50,000. Or no, I think I started out at 25,000, and by the end of all these mini games, I'm at like 60,000. So, I'm way above what really is necessary. Uh, and oh, and then the spike weeds are are really important as well because they can't destroy the spike weeds either so if you just put them underneath them it'll slowly take them out I also get the twin sunflowers just because they give me a little bit extra yeah put that one down there some of these I'm not sure if I'm going to be commentating throughout the whole thing I just want to give you some some tips at the beginning because I know for me uh, a lot of this wasn't that hard, but I know some of the some of them can be. I think I let this one go too. Oh no, I, I just I take it out and then I should probably put the potato mine right there. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's what I do. I put the potato thing there. All right. I'm kind of confused in what my strategy was this time. Because that squash bird, yeah, there you go. Okay, I am, I am thinking. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, I know what I was doing. <coughs> yep. Just keep putting something in their way because I'm going to just wait for that squash probably to get up and kill it. But with two full lines of uh, sunflowers, you shouldn't really be hurting anywhere. Yep, and that'll kill both of them. And then you should put a spike weed on the bottom. There we go. Ah, oh. now you get the walnuts heads, which are which are all which are also very tough. But the spike weeds do do them some amount of harm, so that is a good thing. So at this point, if you've gotten this far, you've pretty much beaten the level. Just put some pumpkins around the tall nuts just to make them feel better. And then, of course, put the 
oh, what is repeaters? That's what it is. The repeaters behind the tall nuts. Because now putting them in before they would have they would have killed gotten killed. And be smart where where you put the pumpkins. I mean, I'd put one over the the one that was crying. If you were actually playing this strategically. However, the reason that I didn't was because I didn't have a spike weed up there when I originally put it there. I didn't realize I was getting a spike weed so quickly. And I'm getting so many uh, sunshine units that I don't mind getting rid of a sunflower, especially since it's not the twin sunflower. <coughs> so yeah, I got rid of that, and then there we go. Yep, got him. And you can use this the squashes kind of sporadically when, whenever you really want to. But I think for this from this part on, I just really just try and put repeaters wherever there are uh, zombie plants. Uh, the final wave should be coming up pretty soon. Yeah, I wouldn't put another one there. You you have three lines of spike weeds. I mean, that should be that should really be plenty. That's the only reason that I haven't. Oh, and then I'm going to put that one right there. Yeah, it's, that's going to be death row. There's no way they're going to get through that. Yeah, see? No. Oh, I went with that one. Oh, yeah, because I have the squash there. That yeah, makes sense. Yep. So this game's over with. So I'll see you guys in the next mini game, Pitching Ace 88, over and out.